Greetings and welcome back to Firewatch. We found Brian Goodwin's little hideout at the, uh, in the last time, and we're back on the Thock of Fair Tale, and we need to get back to the cave. So we're taking this path downwards. We found oh, uh, also, some anchors. Those girls turned up. Looks like you didn't kill them. Nobody did. Oh, they very took good. some farmer's tractor for a joyride down in Riverton and uh, landed in jail. <sighs> wow, that's good. Yeah, I wonder if they know anything. If there's some way to ask them about whatever happened at their camp. I think we'd be smart to let sleeping dogs lie. Yeah. You're probably right. Yeah. She is indeed right about that. Um, what I wanted to say, we found some climbing anchors, which we can now use in the cave. So those little pests of girls which um, really gave us a hard time on our first and I think second and third day, only second day, and then we had a little heart attack when we f figured that um, they might have been killed and we might get framed for that. So this is quite a relief. Okay, yeah. Still going to the left, to the cave. There we go, there's the cave. So... Do we still have the key, is the question. Hopefully. We will see... What we can do. And the cave is now darker than before. Right. Use key. We have the key. Hmm. Okay. Now we're going down here. And I am incredibly curious now. My curiosity has risen so much on what we find down here. We can get back up. For now, that is. There is no sneak option. And yeah, we have to find out now what it is they seek here. I'm not even... oh my, I'm so nervous right now, because I don't know what will happen. It's going down. And downwards. Something has to be here. Do you remember Brian Goodwin's map? He said something about the Iron Fortress being here at Mule Point. But we are right here. Was there a Death Fortress, maybe? Might be. Wow, this cave... Oh, goodness. Somebody died here. Maybe it was Brian Goodwin's father? Or is it... Is it... Is it maybe Brian Goodwin himself? Wow. You... Oh, God. You're Brian Goodwin. Oh, goodness! It is Brian. You fell. Your stuff gave out. Oh, my Poor goodness. Poor fucking kid. So... Wow, he tried to explore whatever's down here. But now... I'm sorry, Brian. I'm sorry. Wow. But now the question remains... 
Was he pushed down here? I don't know, the... Or was the rope broken deliberately? Or was it just a plain accident? Accidents can happen, but I don't believe in coincidences um, in this regard anymore. There were too many of those. So now, let's see what we find. Or maybe they wanted us to find the body. Maybe... I don't know. I... I can't even imagine what, uh, what we will find. It might be shocking. Or it might be plain... boring. Hmm, another steep shaft. Yeah, there are a lot of those. This is a very big and steep cave and yeah, if you are not really a trained a trained climber, it's not a good idea to go climbing and caving in here. Where are we going anyways? We're going this path and coming out at two forks? What? Why? That wouldn't make any sense. But it looks that way. But why isn't anything down here? Nobody behind us. That is a good signal. <sighs> but still... Why are we not finding anything? Why isn't there anything? There are too many questions. I want answers. I want answers. Really. What happened here? What happened to Brian Goodwin? Why were we spied upon? Um. Wow. This is, uh. Well. There is nothing in here. Right? Yeah. So, the cave doesn't go anywhere. And I will go here and see what's in the tower. And let me guess, the radio will now go. And we will hear something. No? Okay. Hey, D. There you are. I've been worrying my ass off. Hey, you, um, might want to take a seat. I've been sitting this entire time. I'm almost always sitting. What's... what's wrong? The only thing in the cave was a body. A body? God, what a mess. Delilah. It's Brian Goodwin. <sighs> Gotta be fucking kidding me. How does that... <clears throat> what? I don't... Climbing, I think, or made to look like a climbing accident. Mm -hmm. mm, one of the things. Are we paranoid or? I don't know, maybe it was Ned. If not him directly, he put enough stupid fucking know how in his head to get him killed. Hmm. Son of a bitch. But why? Yeah. What do we do now, D? I I mean, are you okay? No. I'm not. He'd be alive if I had told someone he was out here. I don't know where he'd be, but I can assure you it would not be rotting at the bottom of that cave. I... There's... there's... there's nothing to say. Hike back. I think we're leaving tomorrow anyway. Hmm. But... Was that it? What about the people who were there? And... Do we now get a different ending? Compared to if I had said something about whoever is out there did this? Oh, and we're taking our typewriter back. Huh. All our notes... Pack up... Belongings. Tracking device... See that plane? 
Uh, no, I was just busy packing up. Let's keep well, there's this. gonna be a lot more. The service says this thing is two percent contained. What well, is this the June fire or the site fire? Or... Well, the two fires merged into one unmitigated disaster. They're renaming it after my lookout. You about packed up? Shouldn't we talk for a sec? You know about things. About what? We still don't know who was listening to us, who was following me around, who made that tape. Yeah, all we have is the body of a dead boy who did nothing wrong. But maybe we can still find these people. Look, I think whoever is out there caused the site fire to cover their tracks, and I'm almost certain that when I get off the helicopter, I'm going to be led into a room and made to listen to a tape of me saying we started it. And we don't know shit. What can I do? Well, there's something for you to do. Holy shit. Holy crap. Yeah. Uh, oh my god. We don't know what it is. It could be nothing. Yeah, it could also be whoever was listening to us. Who, whoever made the tape. Okay. Yeah, um, look, you should pack up everything you need in case we get the call and you can't come back. All right, look, if, if something happens... I'll remember you. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, am I walking into a trap right now? much rather remember you from a bar somewhere and not a jail cell. Please find who made that tape. Well, I don't see anything we would need. Maybe... No, we can't take this, so... Do we want... Now, do we want to put on our re wedding ring or not? Hmm, I think we will put it on. Whatever that means. It is in western direction. So, we will find out. We, will, we might even die doing so. Or something weird happens. I don't know. I'm... I have no idea what will happen now. Medicine wheel, maybe, or the lake trail. There's a way. We will see. I'm getting a little bit paranoid. I think that's to be exact expected. I think this is what the game wants. Yeah, it's behind this debris. Is that a shortcut? Is it is. It is, it is. Are we walking into the fire? I certainly hope not. Oh, where are we walking anyway? We are here. Western direction is Jonesy Lake. I feel like I'm being leaded or led towards something or led on or or would it be a tracking device on a bear I do get a really 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 bad feeling about this or am I am I being too paranoid what's your status I think I'm getting close. Alright, well, I just got word that they are coming to get us. My place. You sound worried. No, it's... it's just... Brian? I'll coordinate with the evac team and let you know when to head towards the tram. It's north. Far. 
past where you found that cut back in May. There's an emergency tram out there that will let you hike to the rendezvous point at my lookout. So, it is... Wow, this would be a... Big walk back there, so... No idea if we even get the chance to do so, but... Just in case I will save the game. <laughs> ah! So tense! And I do not trust the ropes right now. Because of what happened to Brian Goodwin. We're still on track though. Getting closer and closer. Oh god. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. Henry. Cassette tape and a path up there. A collar. Someone left a rope for me to climb up. I'm down near the lake. How do you know it's for you? There's a tracking collar tied to it. Someone was leading me here. And there's another tape. Oh my god, Henry. Take it. And let's see. This is interesting. We found the surveillance operation. Wow. Okay, what does that mean? What is it? It was Ned Goodwin. He was the one listening to us, just him. Hmm. Ned Goodwin? He made the tape? Yeah. He's gone. Deeper into the Shoshone. He doesn't want anyone to know he's out here. Because he killed Brian. Because he killed his fucking son. He, he <sighs> need to get back here. They say the helicopters are making rounds. Okay. Okay, um... Let's climb up. So, what would have happened if we have would have said anything else? I... I still don't really think it is Brian, and why do I get the feeling that the rope will now just break? And we fall down? No? Oh wow. I was wrong. Ah. Who knows? Okay, hiking north now. We need to go there. Let's see if we... Uh, 
we can find the cozy place that Ned was talking about. Um, no, this is not it. No, no. Um, in any case, that was either a conv convincing uh, actor or something different. In, uh, um, I don't know if something will happen, so I will go on the safe route here. I will end the episode right here. Um, in the case that it will only be another five minutes, I will plunk the last five minutes onto this episode. Um, I will only see it in editing, but uh, in any case, thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to leave a like and comment. And I certainly hope to see you next time as well. Until then, yours faithfully, the Pastafarian.